that contained from where we left. So this is the part two of the unboxing. We have been able to watch, connect everything. I mean, Wi-Fi uh, antennas, the UPS to the, I mean, 5G router or router. Now we are going to connect the LAN port. Remember, one thing people don't know: if you connect the LAN port directly to your laptop or to your phone, uh, so I mean, to your laptop or to your TV, smart TV or whatever. You don't even need to insert the uh, password unless maybe you want to use the Wi-Fi side. If not, you don't need to insert password because it will connect automatically. But if you want to connect to the A2, I mean, Wi-Fi via Wi-Fi, then you may need to what input passwords. Okay, I mean, if you are connecting the Wi-Fi to your phone and that stuff. Uh -huh. So now let us check if what I'm saying is true. One, we connect our LAN port to what. Uh, I'm mean, sorry, we connect our what? Yeah, LAN port to the router or router, and we connect it to the laptop as well. So I'm coming. You see, I'm going to connect it to the laptop for us, for us to see. As you can see, I'm connecting. So let me check and connect it perfectly. But you must be gentle. You must be gentle. You must be gentle. You connect. As it's connecting, you see here will be blinking. Now it is it has connected. So as you can see from the laptop here, it has connected. If you can see it clearly here, you see that it has connected. As you can see here. You see it has connected. So now let us check the IP which we are going to input to see if it is going to work. 192.168.0.1. So let's check. Let's check. Let's check. We type 192.168.0.1. As you can see, okay, here, as you can see clearly here. Let me see it well for you to see. For you to see. Okay, then we search. We search for it. We allow it to fully load. You see, as it has loaded fully. The automatic password, okay, to log in into the site is what? Admin, admin. Username is admin, password is what admin, all in small letters. So we type in password, type in, you have type in the username and the password, then you log in, you click on login. You get it. So it has opened for us. It, as you can see, I'm connected to Vodafone. Though the, the device or the machine is not empty. But I use Vodafone SIM because I have already decoded it to what? To be universal so that can accept all network. You get it. So this is it. You see, this is it. You see how fast it's open. The internet is just very fast. The internet is very fast. You see the name of it. So if I'm, I want to connect it to my phone or any other stuff, you get it. The password is as simple as ABC. You can see the password and other stuff, but then the password is saving. So I'm try. I will try to look, connect via some uh, this thing here for us to see Wi-Fi. Okay, the Wi-Fi is on, so I'm going to connect it to this phone for us to see. Then check the name. SSID is the network name. MTN 4G. Okay. So as you can see here, it is here. So I click on it. I'm asked to input the password, but then you see the password boldly written uh, at the back. That is the LAN key. The LAN key. So, uh, sorry, I wanted to show it here. It's showing written at the back of the how do you call it? The device. The LAN key. I believe you can see. That is the password. So I'll type in the password here into this and I'll connect for us to see okay
So after typing the password, I'll click on connect. Let's see if it will connect. It's loading or authenticating. Once it's done, it is connecting. So as I said, once it's done, it will fully connect for us to see. You see, you just have to be patient for it to connect for you. And as it connects, that's all. So we are done, and as you can see, it has fully connected at the top. You can see it has fully connected. Uh, it has fully connected, as you can see. Perfect. So internet to this phone is done. That is how it is. This is how it is. If you wish to change the password, that is at the back of the router or router. Uh, well, that's the LAN key. You can change it here as you open the website. Okay, just open the website. Once it's one nine two one dot one six eight dot zero dot one. You just scroll down. Okay, just scroll down to my Wi-Fi. When you see my Wi-Fi, that's where you can change the actual password of the device, not the website password, but rather the password of the device so that others or intruders do not get access to. I mean, use it. You get it. So here, you can clean the password there. Okay, you can choose to display the password, but I don't want to display the password. Then you type in the password you wish to use. Okay, so let's see. I'm typing in the password I want to use. You get it. Yes. When you are done, just come here to apply here then you click on apply you see simple it's done all connected wi-fi devices we need to reconnect do you want to continue i will say yes waiting 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 this device is powerful very fast even in places where your internet connection is very very low this device will help you what connect to the internet very fast. So, like I've reset the password, so meaning the phone that I connected will have to reset to have access to it. Yes, that's how it is. Uh -huh. Because it, you know, it helps you to protect your online privacy, your password for people not to what intrude on your browsing activities to use your device. I mean, to use your data bundle when you are not aware, unless you yourself give it to them. But if not, you'll be the only one to use it. It's a very powerful machine. The device is very powerful and it's very easy to use. Thank you. So we can scroll to the top to see some other stuff there at the top. You see, we, that's, we are on the dashboard. We can go to quick settings. You get it. You can go to quick settings. To do some one or two quick settings here. I mean, you can change the name, slightly change the name, or leave it like that. You get it. Uh, you can go to device settings. Okay, you can see what's connected. You can see what is connected. You get it. You can see all that stuff. For now, it is only this laptop that is connected. That's how you see it here. Uh -huh okay if there's other stuff that are connected you can see but for now it's only get the uh, laptop because i've implemented the what uh, phone wi-fi from it okay there are so many things you can do here you can check your sms here you can check your data bundles and other stuff your phone number so many things you can do here you can check your phone book to see your phone numbers you get it you can see your firewall and other stuff here. System settings. System settings. System what? Settings. Yeah, you can do some settings here. The date isn't correct. The date isn't correct. Uh, I may choose to change the time zone. You get it. Daylight saving time. Did I change? Maybe. 
uh, we have cleaner bullets. But we do it in time, it's incorrect. I can choose to modify it, to change it, to get it. Uh -huh. I will do that later. You can come to Network Tools, check other stuff, get it. So there are so many things, there are certain things you can do here. There are so many things you can do here. Yes. Then you apply. You can apply to apply. You get it. Later on, like I said, I will modify the dates. So that it can be very good for us. Or should I change it now? Okay, let me change the date. Then go to manual setup. In here I can choose the date. Today's date is what? Uh, we are in what? 2023. Just make it 27. Get it? Yeah, just 27. Then I can wait for some few seconds for it to be exactly like says 27. Then I click on apply. Okay. Yes. Now let me just click on apply. Don't worry. So apply. I'm done. Success. So I'm done setting my dates. I can just change it back to automatic. Whatever I don't do anything. I just click on apply it. <laughs> uh, it's just simple. Okay, so this is just a quick setting about it. I didn't want to go through so many steps, but this is just some simple settings about how to set up your uh, MTM phone router. Maybe there are some time to get work on the five to about as well. Yes. Thank you. Good night. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Shit. Sure.